Kanye West's ex-assistant Lauren Peixota claimed she was drugged and sexually assaulted during a studio session with her former boss and Sean Diddy Combs. Radar Online has revealed the incident reportedly occurred in Santa Monica, California, where the model was allegedly given a drink laced with an unidentified drug. Peixota claims that West ordered a drink for her. She allegedly felt disoriented and lost control of her body and her speech. The next morning, she experienced illness and immense shame with unclear recollections of the evening during the studio session. The filing said Peixota could not recall and was certainly not aware of any kind of sexual assault had happened to her or her former client, and she was more concerned with whether she'd embarrassed herself in front of her client or West. According to the complaint, it was only later that she learned of the alleged assault from West himself, who confessed to having hooked up with her that night. The assault reportedly took place while West was still married to Kim Kardashian, whom he wed in 2014 and later divorced in 2022. The ex-assistant felt disgusted and numb by West's alleged revelation and said she knew in that moment she had to quit working for the heartless rapper. In her lawsuit, she claimed that she had to be extremely careful in the way she distanced herself as she believed she would be silenced, blacklisted, and retaliated against. Peixota, who previously sued West for sexual harassment and wrongful termination, claimed she quit her position as his assistant due to the uncomfortable work environment following the incident. She alleged that she was fired shortly thereafter and never received the $3 million in owed severance pay. According to the lawsuit obtained by Page Six, Peixota stated that she received vulgar texts from West including explicit desires for sexual activities along with intimate photos of Yeezy employees from the rapper. West lawyer have refuted Peixota's allegations, labeling them as baseless and accused her of pursuing West sexually for personal gain. The attorney also claimed that Peixota had blackmailed West when her advances were rejected. They claimed that Peixota attempted to destroy evidence contradicting her claims by stealing West's cell phone before her termination. The attorneys cited her unprofessional conduct and unreasonable demands as reason for her dismissal.